Hey, this month we're coming to Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, and Atlanta, Georgia. Then we're going to Corpus Christi, Texas, New Orleans, Louisiana, Edmonton, Canada, Calgary, Canada, Spokane, Washington, Tacoma, Washington, then Vancouver, Canada, Irvine, Braille, San Diego. We're going all over the place. Go to hardtwinstore.com for tickets. There you go. It's a clean shot right there, man. Man, we hard on this cut. We got serious on this. Yeah, I got me a burrito. It's a good cut meal. Went over there to Fodobo Mexican Grill. Got the black beans. That's good for cutting. I got me some pollo. That's good for cutting. That's grilled. And I got me some of that chimichurri sauce, which is good for cutting. And then I got some, uh, some white rice, which is okay for cutting. Steam rice, which is good for cutting. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, take all of it. Take it all. Hey man, give me, let's get the thumbnail real quick. G do that again. So some, yeah, right there. Don't move. Yeah. See the inside? That's a chimichurri sauce. Ah, oh, shit. Some protein full out. Ah. Three second rule. Hey, you get me a straw? Of course you did, man. I gotta take care of my little brother. He's dropping stuff all over you. This is a good burrito, man. Look in now. Look in now. Is it focused? Hey, you know, I prefer Quadobo over Chipotle. Yeah. Say what? I prefer uh, Quadobo over Chipotle. Me too, man. What happened over there at Chipotle? Ain't nothing happened, man. You just prefer Quadobo. Over Chipotle, man. I lost all kinds of fat. All kinds. Supposed to be fat. We didn't fell off, man. What? We didn't fell off. Fell off of what? My fitness, man. Yeah. We used to inspire people. Now we just fatten them up for slaughter. No, man. Everything we do is for a reason. We ain't got to inspire people. We didn't show people. We didn't got them fat. We've been bulking them up. Everybody's been watching our videos. They've been bulking for the last four years. Now we're going to start cutting. We're going to start doing fitness videos. That's, that's, that's why we've been doing all these eating videos. We've been bulking y'all up. So you can increase your gains, man. Oh, shut up. I ain't gonna eat all this. Tell me the truth, man. We got a problem with food. We some binge eaters. <laughs> <laughs> I have a horrible relationship with food. No, you don't, man. Yeah, I do. Mm -hmm. No. Hey, I want to see horrible, man. There's some people be eating. After their meal, man, they go to the bathroom, take this finger right here, and I Baby's doing crazy shit. Now that's what I consider a horrible relationship with food. Eating disorders. I remember the first time I came across somebody with that. The year was 1995. Believe me, right? I was in the Marine Corps. I was a young Marine. Had my whole life out in front of me. I was talking to this girl. I thought she was cute. I wanted to go deep inside. I was making my move. We went out and got something to eat. And then she said, excuse me, I have to go to the bathroom. I said, you going go into the bathroom, girl. You come out, man. I'm going to stick this card piece deep inside. Right. This was in the rest. This was in the mess hall. Yeah. Work. 
right? So she'd been gone a while. I was like, man, where this girl go? She's sucking somebody off or something. So I went to go looking for her. And um, I said, you seen such and such? Hey, bitch. Hey, bitch. Where you at, bitch? Hey, hey let me tell you the story. <laughs> I said, man, y'all see? She says, yeah, she's in the bathroom. She hasn't came out yet. So I was out there um, standing by the bathroom door. I could hear her going, ah, ah, ah. I said, this stupid bitch in there throwing up. She's making herself throw up. I could tell. She came out. Now look, I said, everything all right? She's looking straight crazy, will not she? Sound like you was in there trying to suck off Goliath or something. Suck who off? Goliath. Yeah, I'm fine. Just got a little, just got a little stomach bug. <laughs> little stomach bug. Sound like you got a damn big ass. I said, ass. girl, I don't even want to talk to you anymore. You stupid. You in there throwing up and stuff. I ain't got time. You hit it first, right? Oh, man. That girl was stupid anyway. She didn't like me. She, she was in the white boys. Man, she had a twin sister? Oh, yeah. I remember her. She was Mexican or something. She said, I'm sorry. I don't date black guys. I only date white guys. But you got some pretty eyes. She just told me well, I'm only half black. I was fitting to cuss her ass out. She's racist. Oh, damn, the burrito. That burrito gone, man. He gone. Eat whatever the f you want to eat. Damn. Title of this email, Underage Girl. Young and tender. I had me on an age girl once. She was sweet. Shut up! <laughs> hey twins, I'm 27. <laughs> <laughs> hey man, come on man, this is uh gonna creep people out. Ain't nobody got no um evidence. I think I and, and especially too, man, it's no track worker, so I ain't been doing it like my whole life, so uh, the statute of limitations in the past. They can't touch me. Kim, shut up. I'm just saying. I, ain't, I, ain't, I don't up. mean to brag anything, but they can't touch me. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Twiz, I'm 27 and I have a problem that's been killing me for the past two weeks. <laughs>